the Duke of Sussex will meet England's national rugby team and their head coach Eddie Jones before sitting down for a question and answer session with England rugby's co captain Dylan Hartley. Harry will then speak to England's former international rugby players and World Cup champions, including Johnny Wilkinson, Lawrence Delaglio, and Jason Leonard. The Duke of Sussex, who is a patron of the Rugby Football Union, will be holding the event to honor two charities close to his heart. The reception support try for change an England rugby program to support disadvantaged young people and mental health charity the Johnny Wilkinson Foundation. Prince Harry joined excited fans in Twickenham last week to watch England win their the Six Nations match with France. Harry was seen belting out the national anthem as he cheered on the team in their second victory of the tournament. The Duke also spoke to young fans involved in the CBRE All Schools program an initiative which aims to increase rugby participation in secondary state schools. He asked the children what they enjoyed about the game, adding, it's a fantastic sport. George Reynolds, 12, of Marsh Academy, said, we were just talking about sport, the Invictus Games and all of that. I'd expected him to speak really posh but he's just really normal. Tiago da Costa Consigo, 12, of Kemmel Technology College, said, he said to cheer for England and in rugby try to go to the top and set goals. Harry also discussed the difficulty young players face when transitioning to adult rugby. Damien Orton, of Sherborne Rugby Football Club in Dorset, said, just as he was going I wanted to wish him well. It's the greatest adventure. Every day is new. We all respect him, he's a marvelous example to everybody, and he gives so much of his life to other people. It's nice to be able to give a thank you back occasionally.